But in that process, I was exposed to somebody who was an abstract expressionist, and I was exposed to this idea of painting being a spiritual activity. It wasn't simply making a nice object. Because painting can be really boring. It can just be like making a cake. You know, it's something, and I wanted it to be this other thing. I mean, I had this experience of painting that uh, was forgetting. It was this moment where I could record time, where it was life was in time was suspended, and the painting just happened, and I honestly don't know how I did it. So I'm looking for that. I'm not looking for a certain format or a certain look or to agree with a certain kind of genre. You know, I'm interested in the painting under the painting. And so if you think of it not as an additive process, but as a subtraction that you're in this process of uncovering, it's an archeological uh, motive as much as it is kind of digging, you're doing all these things, moving earth. Oh, my head springs to life. And then the whole painting can kind of, it's, it sounds really goofy, but that's really how it is. And so I'm doing these paintings of uh, sky, which are 100, almost 100% like just dots and color, and it's <laughs> completely ridiculous, but uh, I find it very difficult to just leave them that way. I, I mean, uh, I put in figures lying down, I'm thinking about uh, Roybal and people sleeping, and I'm always thinking about other painters and um, invoking different kind of spaces. 